Hello out there and welcome to English Teacher Plays. We're here with I Will Eat You, which is a new game. It's on Steam and full disclosure, I did receive my copy for free. And we're going to go ahead and we're going to play. Um, I guess let's find a server. Find a game. Give us a server, please. So we can play. So we can play I Will Eat You. The music's by Kevin McLeod, because of course it is. And... And I guess there are no servers. Okay, that's fine. We will create our own server. Nice. Sure. Classic. Deer mode, raccoon mode. Okay, we'll have to look at those. Let's play... Let's play this one. It looks fine. Enter the title. Uh, Mr. Jacobs. <clears throat> no, no password. Let's just go. Alright. Beast win. Press C to get a reward. I got a reward, I guess. Alright. So we're playing I Will Eat You. Um. Alright. We can dance as well. Right. Okay, I don't know what we're doing though. We can wave. I don't, all right, I don't, one out of two players winning, so we need one other player to play. All right, well, that might mean that we don't get to play. So it's a multiplayer only game, is that, is that what the dealio is? Can I, can I, can I Skyrim up the top? I can't. It's blocked. It won't let me go up, all right. Well, let's just keep looking, I guess. It's very... There's a lot of saturation here. A lot of, um... Bloom, I guess. I don't know. I don't know what the effect is, but... Alright. So, we're just... We're just looking at the edge of the map. So, I guess... I guess the point is... That someone is gonna play the beast. And someone's gonna play the human. And you have to escape. I, I just... I don't know. I don't know what's supposed to be happening. We've got our game... We are playing, but there is no game to play. Oh, there's the cave. Let's go check out the cave, if that is a cave. Hopefully there's a bear in there or something. We can get some content. Oh, no, it's just an empty cave. And that, it doesn't go past that point. All right, well, let's keep going around the edges, and we'll see what we can find. All right, I think we might be, we might have nearly got there. We might, oh, we can duck. And hide. I guess there's some hiding places. Yeah. I don't... I Look, I don't know. Alright, let's... Yeah, let's go to the main menu. Let's go out to the main menu and let's try out one of the other modes and see if that... What does characters do? So we can... Sure. Bear, wolf, boar, tiger. I don't know. Let's be a boar. Sure. All right, so we bought a boar. Um, let's create a uh, let's create a server. Let's play deer mode. What is or oh, what is raccoon mode? Let's do that one. Oh, uh, I'm just so we're playing deer mode. I don't know what that means. So we got some more money and some more XP, of course. Right, so we're really tiny now. We're in big room mode. Can we can we hide in here? No. All right, so what about going upstairs? Look, I, so it's the same thing again. We're just in a big room now. We can't move those, okay? So we've got some time on the clock, and the stairs are not for going up. Right. That's some music we can listen to, and we can make that noise. Great. All right, let's exit out of that. I don't know what deer mode is. All we've seen is uh, being able to play as a human. So let's try raccoon mode. Um, let's try this this one here. Let's go be a raccoon. Yeah, and we keep getting. So we won because the beast. So we're getting some XP at least. Um, so the game is just exit out and enter in. Okay, so we can go into this little uh, tent. There's some tanks, I guess. So this is raccoon mode, guys. 
Whatever that means. Um, I mean, is this game new or is it old? Is it dead? I just, I do not know what's supposed to be going on here. Um, I'm just getting a, a sensation like there's not anything to do. Hey, we made it up to the roof at least. That's cool. Oh, there's like, um, yeah, so we can hang out on the roof. And then other people would have to come find us, I guess. Ooh, can we... I wonder if we can launch, our launch ourselves over the edge. Boing! Oh, not quite. Okay, well, we did try. No one can say we didn't try. Can we get up on that is the question. Can we get up on that. No, there's barbed wire there. Ooh, maybe we can jump on from here. There we go. Now we should be able to... No. Oh, we're... No, we're stuck. All right, so we can't jump over the fence. Fine, let's just go look around. Right, so this one has different music. So every time we put music on, it's different. I do like that, that's cool. Um, so I actually have no idea what the point of the game is. Um, because it doesn't appear to be any single player content. Um, yeah, I did. I received my copy for free, but I, I don't know what it was that I was supposed to do with my single player copy. I guess we're dancing now. We're doing the chicken dance. Got some music. And stick our tongue out. All right. Um... Yeah, I don't know, man. Let's go out to the main menu. I guess let's just go look at the description because obviously no one's playing. So, yeah. All right, I will eat you. Run, hide, shout, and try to survive in the game full of fun and funny moments. Play with random players or with your friends. Uh, but whatever you do, do not enter the den of the beast. It has very positive reviews, came out last year, um, and it costs $2.20. So it's very cheap. It is very cheap to buy, which is cool. Um, and they've got lots of people uh, with videos who like it, which is cool, but no one's playing and there's no single player content. So I don't see how the game's going to continue to earn these positive reviews. Premier is bad, gameplay is bad, it's buggy, it's pointless, it's not worth the $1.74. 150 minutes tops, there is zero like, like zero content. Right. Um, however, it's glitchy, not... Nah. Right. Received the game as a gift from a friend, and so bad he asked me if I cared if he filed for a refund request for my copy too. I no longer own the game. You do the math. Right. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, like, look, the game is probably quite fun, I guess, if you had some people to play with. But the problem is, is you, like, le legit actually just need people to play with. Um, and despite having 129 positive reviews, or, you know, 129 reviews, uh, mostly positive... Um, it doesn't seem like anybody's playing the game. Uh, so, in a game that is 100% uh, multiplayer only, what's going to happen is the same thing that happens to even really, really, really popular games is that their player based dwindles, people stop playing, and it's done. Let's have a look at GSE as a developer, see what all they got. They've got I Will Eat You and a game called Gok. Whatever that is. Right. So, that came out. Yeah, alright. So, look, I'm sure that the game is actually pretty fun to play, but uh, I can't recommend it because as all, the, uh, as all these games go, when the game is multiplayer only, um, you can't really, you can't expect the player base to be there to play this game, you know? There's not like a competitive aspect to it, it's not like you can expect people to keep playing it. Um, if there was like a couch co-op mode, I could maybe see this, you know, like people playing it in a LAN or whatever. Um, but I just definitely don't see it happening. I'm, lo I'm loving the little trailer here though, you know, people running around, running away from the bear. That's all very cool, that guy's playing guitar and stuff. <laughs> yeah, you know, there's a lot of cool stuff going on here, but yeah, the crux of the matter is no one is playing, therefore the game is not, not good to go. So I'm gonna leave it there. That's I Will Eat You. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. If you want to check out the game yourself, you can. But like I said, no one's playing. And uh, leave me a comment below. And otherwise, I'll see you guys next time. Class dismissed.